you guys saw that, all those linemen trucks heading toward the East Coast. Since the last time I told you we had seen over 200, that right there makes about 34 that we've seen over the 200. So it's roughly 33 to 233 to 234 trucks we have seen just on Interstate 20 heading to the East Coast because of the hurricane. All right. They are definitely prepared for something rough out there. Ladies and gentlemen, the present count just on Interstate 20 heading west, there we have counted 263 lineman trucks heading to the east coast. Now, if you can see these trees, that 263 is the ones we saw. We, we don't know how many went by us when the trees were so thick that we could not see the other highway. That's preparation, friends. I don't know how many FINA trucks have even started up yet. These boys are on the ball, putting their life on the line for your convenience. Hello, folks. Uh, I've made several uh, video clips of the uh, electric uh, power company's uh, linemen heading toward the East Coast <clears throat> in uh, preparation for the hurricane. These videos were made, uh, well, uh, none of them came out except for the first two. Anyway, my uh, last count was over uh, 360 trucks that we saw just on Interstate 20 from... Uh, about midway between the uh, uh, coast and Atlanta, Georgia. I, no, I'm sorry. Uh, South Carolina. At, yeah. Anyway, wherever 20 goes. Anyway, from midway, we uh, were traveling 20 down toward uh, uh, Georgia, South Atlanta, Georgia. And... Uh, we saw over 360 trucks heading for the uh, the coast. Anyway, that was just one highway, and we don't know how many came out on the highway after we passed by. So I'm guessing somewhere in the neighborhood of five or 600 just on that one interstate, uh, and that was on the 12th, which was a Wednesday. The hurricane hit on Friday. By Saturday afternoon, they said on the news that there was almost one million. It was like uh, 960,000 uh, families were out were without electricity. This morning, the uh, uh, the twentieth is one week later, uh, and all of a sudden, there's only 200 families without uh, power. So these guys do an amazing job. Now I do know that. Uh, they get paid very well, but that is a very, very dangerous job. And these guys don't have to go. They're asked to go. It's volunteer all the way. And I mean, they leave the comfort and safety of their homes and their families to go out and restore power. I think they deserve a little bit of thank you. So if you don't mind, at the bottom in the comments, just please, just put a thank you. And all the linemen, this video is going to be dedicated to the linemen. They'll know that the thank you is for them. Thank you very much. And if you can, help it go viral. Let's get a lot of thank yous of these brave young men and women. Okay? Thank you.